Guys, we're being overrun by zombies, so today we're gonna show you how to properly dispatch of them with shotguns. We have all kinds of different loads ranging from, well, we have a 20 gauge up through a 10 gauge three ounce, so that's what we got. Wax slugs, we got steel ball bearings, egg sinkers for slugs, and uh, well, regular loads, but let's into the dis- world loads. Yeah, into the world loads. Let's dispatch of these zombies. Well. That one zombie right there, it kind of resembles Ty's getting kind of close. So I've got here 15 pellets of double lot loaded with some black powder. You know, we're trying to stick with the theme of uh, we're out of everything, the world's going to crap. So let's see what it does. I'm going to shoot you right in the face, Ty. Huh. Well, he's still coming. Good thing we got plenty more for him. Somehow a single pellet did not hit that thing. He ain't kidding. There's not a single pellet on it. Nope. But while we're up here, let's go ahead and take the time. That one's Tyler. That one's uh, his wife. That one's supposed to be me. That one's supposed to be my wife. Would y'all thank my wife for these creative drawings? This is her idea. This one was her idea, and I think it's really cool too, Ty. Anybody guess what TSS stands for? Well, guys, I think the reason he didn't hit any, this is a uh, straight cylinder bore 16 gauge, no buffer, black powder, but this is 18 pellets of 29 cal. I shot a little high. This is supposed to be me. You got pellets all in the head and one right in the mouth. One in the eyeball. Yep. <laughs> well, I believe that one's dead. Okay, so I'm gonna try to pop Josh over there in the face with a 16 gauge slug. Then I'm gonna shoot myself in the face. Zombies. Oh, I You missed. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing, I'm gonna get eat too. Let's see, try that again. That one got him right in the eye, I think. Can't really tell from this far away. Yeah, let's we'll see though. Shoot myself right in the nose. I believe you got it. Right in the mouth, I think. Yep, right in the chin. It looks like I'm still safe. I think you are. Don't get too close now, it'll eat you. Looks like I hit right here, and I guess I missed my second shot. Oh, I see it. Shot a little high. Yep. That one over there that's supposed to be my wife with a head crooked creeps me the crap out, so. <laughs> Tired of that one. I think I hit it. Yeah, the paper definitely moved. That's buckshot, my friend. That what the slug. Yeah, you, the other one's a slug. Oh, I thought that one was... I thought that one was a slug. Oh, well, let's shoot your wife in the face with this one. I think that one was buckshot, too. Could have been. What all did you have? Just them two. Well, one of them was definitely a slug. That was birdshot. I took your wife out with birdshot on that one. Oh, uh, I shot all three slugs. My bad. That was number six shot, I think. Oh. Well, I definitely took care of that one. Hopefully. <laughs> yep well i hit my two all right guys i got this one well i ain't got it he's got it loaded up with full four steel ball bearings he can speak more on it here in a second but that zombie's getting kind of close to us so two in the throat those were i think half inch steel ball bearings they weigh 0 0.22 ounces each Total payload of seven eighth ounce. But uh, there you go. Tear right in the uh, throat. Maybe you wanted the collarbone, but that's not so bad for 10 yards, I guess. Let's see what some 20 gauge slugs will do to him. Shot myself right in the chest. And I can't, I shot Josh right in the middle of the chest too. <laughs> Those holes are a little unusual. Yeah, they're uh, clear 20 gauge holes. Minus the riding on them. Yeah. A little acetone though, that comes right off. 20 gauge slugs? Uh, which one do I shoot? Call one. Uh, Alley. Right in the chest. Yeah, boy. Right in the chest. 
got Josh right in the chest. Right in the chest. Let's feed these things to double lot. This was 12 pellets of double lot. I don't like the way you're looking at me, sir. Quit looking at me. Okay, that is gross. This was 10 pellets of 36 cow. Well, I killed the husband, might as well kill the wife. This thing kicks. Ew. Extremely lightweight single shot. I took all the lead and the recoiled compensators out of the stock the other day to let it beat on my buddies. Yeah. <laughs> you guys saw that video. It was a short. I don't think those survived that at all. No. Yeah, your wife might. Good try, old son. That is a nasty pattern. Which other one did you shoot? My wife. That was triple lot buck in this one. Yeah. Not bad. Nine pellets of double lot. That rock that paper. This one is 14 pellets of 31 cal. I had quite a bit more recoil. And this one is 32 pellets of number four buck. There's a big hole right in that face. <laughs> that is a nasty pattern. That was the uh, 14 pellets of 31 cal. You can see the number four buck spread out everywhere too. Alrighty guys, I'll do some wax slugs. Maybe you ain't got no solid projectiles. You need to make some. Let's see what happens here. Oh, I missed that one by fuzz. It's still coming at me. Oh no, oh no. What will I ever do? I believe that one took care of it. Yep. Right in the cheek. We're using single shots today because, well, we enjoy shooting them. <laughs> yeah, this ain't a serious video, so we ain't going for best patterns. So why not play with what we like? Yeah. More wax slugs. If you don't know about these, well, just Google search them. Let's see here. See if you can't ring the steel with one of them. Huh? See if you can't ring the steel with your last one, doesn't it? Ring the steel, okay. By God, you got it. Yeah, wax slugs are generally generally pretty accurate, guys. Rain's picking up. I clip sailing right in the hair. <laughs> I hit this one right here, and I missed right here. Oh. Well, I know I hit it. Did you shoot at this one too? Yeah, I don't think that hole was here because I shot it with buckshot, and that hole wasn't there. I think I don't know. I can't Let me go remember. back and look. That's where I shot it. That's where I said I shot it in the face, though. Oh. I know that one I hit. Oh. I thought you shot me with the other one. I did. Right in the mouth. Yeah, right in the mouth. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> How am I supposed to eat brains? Not with your mouth. <laughs> and then, steel steel plate. I can't tell where the wax slug hit, but you guys obviously saw I hit it. All right, guys, time for the big boy. This is my 36 inch barrel 10 gauge. One of my favorite guns in our whole collection. We've got some heavy loads for it, but this one is the exact opposite of heavy. It's a blank. Now, this is 63 pellets of number four buck. It's a three ounce load and they're moving about 1200 FPS. Wait, uh, wait for this smoke to clear. I'm gonna take out Josh. I'm gonna take out Tyler here in a second. Oh yeah, that'll wake you up. It's still early in the morning here, guys. This one is 24 pellets of double lot buck. So another three ounce load. Yeah, it's not 11 o'clock. I'm gonna take out, oh, let's see. Myself, why not? Recall's not really as bad as you think it'd be. And to finish it off, I have a, uh, a two ounce egg sinker and two and seven eighth inch. Let's see what it can do. 
take out, well, let's take out Josh again. Why not? <laughs> you hit the ground in front of me. Did I really? No, you, you put out my left eye. Yeah, I can see it now. The wad hit the ground in front, though. That got there quick, too. This thing is so much fun, guys. I've got 61 pellets of number four buck. God, that is ridiculous. I don't think I've shot a three ounce load in a while either. Oh, take that, my wife. <laughs> I've got 24 pellets of double lot. Tyler's wife won't shut up, so. Take that. That hit that paper so hard. And then I've got a two ounce egg sinker. I think I'll try to hit the plate with it, honestly. All right. I don't know if I can or not, but I'm gonna try. Got it. Got the plate. Woohoo! That hit me in the nuts. <laughs> like Jaron in a 300 blackout, nearly every single round I fired the case, came back and busted him right in the nuts before he decided to move. Yep. Oh man, I love that gun so much. I do too. I gotta back up over here to get it all in frame. <laughs> 24 pellets of double up. I think they're mostly right here. Yeah. Let's see here. Guys, that is 24 pellets of double lot buck right there. And it is true, 33 cal double lot. This right here is what's left of 24 pellets of double lot. Yeah, that's a swarm. Let's see. Josh rocked the plate with one of them two ounce egg sinkers. I got Josh right in the eye with a two ounce egg sinker. And then my wife got hit with 61 pellets of number four buck. Granted, it looks like she caught a few in the shoulder and in the old ponytail, but yeah. There we go. I still don't think they're moving. No. Guys, I want to say thanks for watching and really appreciate it. It's been a lot of fun. It has been. What do you think? Should we do stuff like this a little more often? Maybe next time we'll shoot turkeys and then Santa Claus and reindeer and whatnot. And what do you yeah. think? The evil Christmas hunters. Sounds good to me.